Oh, Eckhart, you are the very limit. Hi! Hi, Christian! I, I didn't see you I was there. right here, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to interrupt your moment with your book and your spidey cup. Not at all. Um, so what's going on? Are we... So I, you have been so popular on the Twitter since the vlog dropped, that's what the kids say, uh -huh. um, with, with By your... the way, this tasted terrible. I just <laughs> washed it with an old sponge. Go on. You've been so popular with your book recommendation from last week that I thought maybe we could do a weekly segment with Christian Borrell. Any ideas? I'm as... honored. Well, in, in that case, welcome to what we are calling Christian Borrell's BOOM! <laughs> Oh. Um, wherein we will discuss every week a different book. I'm going to recommend something that I have read or am currently reading. Fantastic. How's that sound? I think it sounds so great. Um, with me, as always, is my sidekick, uh, Baron von Stanchenmerken. <laughs> I, I know, I know. <laughs> just, <laughs> if you can just be patient, we'll <laughs> All right, moving right along. Um, here is my book. <laughs> Um, I have some books that I have yet to read, one of which is The Complete Works of Shakespeare. That's ironic. Uh, uh, <clears throat> um, Dune, a classic. Highly recommend. We'll get to that in week four. Oh. Um, the Brief Wondrous Life of Oscar Wilde, recommended by my good friend Sutton Foster, oh. an up-and-comer. Keep your eyes peeled for her. Interesting name. She's on the up-and-up. Oh. Iliad, never read it. I am not going to get to it. <laughs> of course we have the Star Wars, William Shakespeare Star Wars trilogy. Fantastic. If you didn't know... Baron, have you read oh. it? <laughs> but it's a work, it's still... <laughs> but the idea is... <laughs> At some point we'll have a special comic book segment. This is my comic book stack. Um, the state of comics is very, very tricky right now. We'll get to some fantasy novels and all that kind of good stuff later, but this week I actually want to talk about, very briefly, about Eckhart Tolle's A New Earth. Fantastic! That sounds amazing! Baron, have you read A New Earth? No, I can do that. Exact, that's exactly my point. Mm-hmm. No, 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 no. He's a riot. <laughs> well, he makes a very good point. Um, I've read this book about three or four times. Have you ever read it? No, I have not. Um, whenever I feel like I need to feel at peace out in the world, like you know how you have those moments at Starbucks? Baron, no. you know how you have those moments at Starbucks where you're waiting in a line and there are stanchions. You're standing, you're standing behind a stanchion and you're going crazy because either things aren't moving fast enough or people are driving you crazy. This is the book that gives me peace at moments like that. Uh, Fantastic. Right. Um, also, it's good with dealing with the ego. Uh -huh. It's great with dealing with uh, that voice in your head when you create a story where you have a, a fake argument with someone that will never actually happen, but you devote energy to having a fake argument and you get all riled up. This helps quiet that. Fantastic. These are deep thoughts with Christian Borrell Most from the book nook. Thank you. See, it's catching on. This has been the first edition of Christian Borrell's...